Guitar Geekery. Today I'm going to play another game of Guess How I Got That Tech. Give you five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, give up. I love using unconventional methods to record and get different tones, and today's rig is no exception. First, I'll start with the star of the show. I'll start with the star of this rig, an old teal stripe TV bandit. Now this is an amp that spent over a decade sitting in my parents' basement not being played. Up until earlier today, it had not worked in a long time, but I finally got it working again. Let's run through what I did here. Still pretty dirty. Let's look at the back of the amp. I'm running from the preamp out to A more radar. I have this set on a Marshall 4x12. I'm not sure exactly which one. I think this is a greenback. And I have the power amp simulator on. I'm set to an EL34 input pretty guns, so it's hitting the simulation of the power amp pretty hard. Uh, not much presence or additional output. Using an SM57, a little bit off the cabinet edge, not too far in the distance. What I do with the EQ on here is I have essentially the roll off of the low end at 450 hertz. And that kind of gets rid of all the rumbly sounds. Other trick to recording like this is you see from the power amp in, I just have a cable hanging out. Now what that does is I'm using the preamp out of the PV here, but I'm silencing the amp in the room by having this dummy cable and the power amp in. I'm using the lead channel with the SuperSat register trademark all the way up, but I don't have the gain button pushed in, so this is the lower gain of the two options. Little bit of mid and treble on the voicings, and the reverb pretty high. For the guitar, I have my trusty parts caster here with a Telecaster, and I used the Fender Noiseless neck pickup for most of that. I switched to Seymour Duncan Little 59 for a little bit, and actually have this with a 50s wiring on. And this, of course, is a PV Predator neck on here. I love PV. 
So anyways, thanks for playing along. Be sure to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at guitarguychuck, facebook.com slash chucksguitargeekery, and my blog at chucksguitargeekery.com. Until next time, cheers.